It's nice to see you. Is this your wife? My wife. Oh, no, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. You are married to the handsomest man in the world. Well, you're right about that. Wait, and you are married to the prettiest woman. I know that. Right, it's nice to meet you. Have a nice night. This next song is very special to me. And it was titled by my wife, Lindsay, who I love more than anything. And I give it to you the rose. Take it the rose. Because I think she was just like a lot of us. They wanted to get out of a place, wanted to get out of a town, and she got the fuck out of it. But you never forget what it's like to wear a drugstore perfume. Wow, I just wish we had a month off to do. <clears throat> I honestly hang out with my wife. Yes, you just got married. What was I it, did. September? I did, yeah, September. So you, uh, bloody hell, you, you, uh, did you have a honeymoon or anything? No, but but we both travel so much and tour so much that like being home in a in an apartment together was was like that. So her um, her name's Lindsay, is yep. that right? Mm -hmm. And and she plays in a band, Mindless Self Indulgence. Mm -hmm. I haven't heard them, I must say. But um, how did you guys meet up? We actually met. We opened for Mindless Self Indulgence. Um, I'd say four or five years ago, four and a half years ago, maybe. Um, and uh, she just really liked uh, our band, and we were this little baby band, and, and they were doing, like, multiple sold-out nights at Irving Plaza in New York, and, you know, they gave us a really great break, you know, mm. and um, that that was actually when we first met, and uh, I had been a fan of the band before I even started my own band. Like, I already had their CDs, and I, I love that band, so um, it was a really, you know, it was a super fun opening for them, and, and we... We kind of hit it off back then, but I was in a relationship, and you know nothing ever transpired. But, Did it feel um, a bit weird having a crush on somebody in a band? It's it's almost a bit like a cliche, you know, being a bit of a groupie yourself. Yeah, I it, it was you know I yeah it was it was a little it was, it was first I don't really I don't get crushes on people either so. If Lindsay, my daughter Bandit, my and my band, my best friends and my brothers, and they really inspire me. 
Hello, sir. So we got the proud husband of the artiste. Yes, very proud. Okay, what what a, a genius, beautiful lady she is. She's amazing. Um, she did all of this amazing stuff in a very small window of time over a year because I'd be off working uh, really late. But she, I don't know how she did it. She she did it from like the hours of uh, like ten to four, if that, you know, and and just so dedicated and amazing. I want to step into those pieces and just immerse I myself. I love them. I bought one really early before the whole set was done. So you're the VIP collector. You yeah, get you I get the special sneak preview in on the one, but they all I think they're almost all gone. We gotta yeah. wait for the next batch now. Yeah, absolutely. I'm just she's just so amazing. She's an amazing fine artist, and I'm I'm lucky and proud to be married to her. You know, me and Linz both just went on a journey together, and we were both very supportive of each other. And it's kind of funny to it's amazing to see it all finally come at the same time. We're very lucky family. The first time. I met my wife. She was watching us play this little scummy, sweaty band playing the knitting factory, and my pants were covered in duct tape and shit, and my my shoes, my shoes covered in it. And she said she fell in love with me. Bro. I wish she was here. Actually, my wife, Linz, she, she asked me too. She's like, are we going to get to be in the orchestra? And I was like, I was like, I'm not sure. And if you do a party and invited everyone you knew, you would see the biggest gift would be from me. And the card attached would say, thank you for being a friend. Thank <laughs> you. 